Vacation. We are here back at Cedar Point for Hollow Weekend. So if you watched our opening day video, we said we were going to be back and we are back. So right outside Blood on the Bayou, this is a scare zone. Uh, today is actually a media content creator event. So Cedar Point, uh, big shout out, thank you. We did get a Fright Lane Pass. This is available to skip the line, kind of like a fast lane. We also got one of the interactive lanterns. So we're going to be walking around checking out all the interactive spots today checking out Hollow Weekend, so thanks for watching and I hope you enjoy this real family vacation. Alrighty, so this was a great opportunity from Cedar Point, so thanks again for inviting us out to this media day for content creators. So normally you can't film inside a haunted house at Cedar Point, so this was really cool for us to walk through a Fear Ground Freak Show a haunted house back in Frontier Town uh, and get some footage inside the house. So we've never been able to really do this before. Last year, if you've seen our video uh, for media day, we were inside the haunting of Erie Estate, but we really didn't get to walk through the whole, whole maze. So this was really cool. We could walk through. This is the second half of the maze uh, that you're seeing right now. So you'll have to come check out Hollow Weekends if you want to see the first half. Um, but it was really cool during the uh, event to, to walk through and, and see everything and I wanted to share it with everybody here. Um, we loved the uh, content creator event overall. It was a lot of fun. We got to hang out in that kind of big tent area and grab a bite of the Hollow Weekend's food, which was so good. And now off to the opening ceremonies. And tonight we are here to bring to life mysteries by performing a feat that has never been attempted in the park. We are going to contact the other side with these. Everyone, raise your lanterns high. The time has come for us to break the seal. Black as ink, black as pitch. I sense your foreboding, your sense of dread. Give me one scream and I will wake the dead. <laughs> We are trying the tag here. It's this solid color, I think. Okay, so how do I tag her? I don't know. Just touch each other. Well, push the button. Maybe try and push the button, I think. Oh, see? You're it. Uh-oh. I think, I don't know if there's more to that or not. Cool. You bring the lantern up. We'll start over. Oh, and there's a spooky guy. Cool. And that's about it. So yeah, keep an eye out for these. There is an interactive map. I'll put a link down in the description, but that's how you find these with the lantern. It tastes um, like Kool-Aid that maybe needs like a little bit more sugar, but it's not bad. I wanted the Mystic Moonlight, 
which is basically the same thing except blue raspberry instead of strawberry. They do have my straw holder, which is my favorite, and it is bubbly from the dry ice, which I love, and then the sugar on the rim. But it's good. I don't think I would get this flavor again, but I like it. Give it a score. You got it. Oh, no. <laughs> I would give it a four. Okay, four. So we'll try the other ones, though, next time. Mm-hmm. Oh, there he goes. Hey. Cool. All right, so we just did the Midnight Maze. So this was new last year, and I'll put a link to our video here uh, from last year. But uh, this was a new house, and we really liked it this year. It was chock full of scare actors. So I'll be honest, like last year, I was disappointed and I talked a lot of smack this year because I was like oh I just wasn't excited for it it was really good not only really did they good. step up their scare actors but they changed a lot of things a inside of things. and it it was like an entirely new haunted house yeah. even though it had the same name and I, I liked it a lot like I'd give it like an 8 out of 10 yeah I give it a 9 out of 10 it was so good it was it's getting Getting close to some of the big, uh, big haunted houses yeah. that we've been to. Like we've both been to HHN. That was comparable. I, yeah, they it, got they got me a lot of times. Yeah, you yeah, got it was scared. good. They did a really good job. There was a lot of scare actors. So definitely check out Midnight. It's a great haunted house. Let's go to the next. All right, so we just went through Haunting of Erie Estate. So we definitely did this house last year on opening night, and it was great. We really love this house. But this year, we were able to bring in the lantern. Show the lantern! And it did react with the house. It's very cool. And they added a lot of like digital screens. It's very just high like, tech. Just uh, like, what is it? Just like uh, Midnight, it was like we expected to see the same house because it's the same name. And it was a lot different. It was There was a lot of scare actors. And they did a lot of like new additions to it that really added a lot to it. I liked it a lot. I would say this is another like eight or nine out of ten. It was really good. Yeah, yeah. So for me, it's another is an eight out of ten all day long. It was very good. So definitely check this one out. And it was cool. They had like the whole like ESP crew there. They're like, oh, this is crazy. So definitely a lot of fun. So on to the next. Here we go. This way, blood on the bayou. It might work here. Oh. We don't want any people down here. Oh, <laughs> oh boy, you got me. That was the first time. <laughs> it's blowing. <laughs> You're like, cool. He's like, Shazam. All right, I've been got. It's official. Eee. Just finished for the night. So much fun. Um, definitely gonna have to come back. We're gonna come back to Cutthroat Cove, Corn Stalkers, and then uh, it's probably, uh, oh, Club Orpheus. Uh, if you made it this far, hit the su subscribe. It's free for you, it really helps us out. We're tired, can you tell? Dude, I'm so tired. <laughs> so tired, I'm old. But uh, we had a great time. Uh, again, big shout out. Thanks Cedar Point for inviting us out. So we'll be back. Make sure you hit that subscribe button again if you liked it because I'm going to be doing some more. We're going to do the kids stuff and we're going to do some more of the houses. So thanks for watching and I hope you enjoy this real family vacation. Wait, wait. Real spooky family vacation.